Hey, 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 Virgo. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your reading. So this is going to be a reading for my Virgos. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Virgo, if you would before you leave. I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs. Information can be found in the description box below. Don't forget to comment as well. Let me know if this resonates. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. And don't forget to check out my new channel, Nature Speaks 333 and subscribe like and watch a video i post every day a channeling from the trees for the collective okay so we have the seven of pentacles the fool card the five of chalices here and the king of chalices somebody's sad about you Somebody, Virgo, has regrets about the past. And they're walking towards you to see if you feel the same. Not that, well, they want to take a leap of faith with you on here. They want to invest in this relationship again. I do feel that they are sincere. It could be a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. All right, now if this is somebody new, because I'm getting two stories here. Interesting, because Taurus got old and new as well. If this is somebody new, you may pick up on this sadness with them about a past love for them. So just know that it's not you. They don't want to repeat their their mistakes, quote unquote, that they've made in the past with love relationships. And if this is new, I, I feel like they're being very, very cognizant about moving forward with you because they don't want to repeat those mistakes, okay? They may open up to you, not right away about this, but as time goes by, Five of Pentacles is clarifying the Seven of Pentacles here. Okay, if this is somebody old, they may have ghosted you. They may have left you out in the cold. If this is the new person, this is a fear of theirs. And I, I feel like it may have happened to them in, in the past relationship here. So we have Eight of Wands and Knave of Wands. I do feel that this new person is going to feel a lot of passion towards you. New or old here, they're going to have a lot of optimism towards this relationship and its future. They do see a future and feel a future with you, Virgo, if this is new. If this is old, you guys had a lot of sexual energy between you. But it, they're saying it was lacking in stability for some reason. They're saying if this is related to the past. Okay, this person was all over the place, they said. I, I'm not sure if it's, you mean they're... Um, it's almost like their mental faculties would, were just all over the place. Tell me about this fool. And that's the lacking in stability. They weren't stable within themselves. So how could they even bring stability to the relationship here? Eight of chalices. 
Yeah, despite them walking away, they want you to take a leap of faith. Hmm. I'm trying to get this new person's um, okay this new person if this is a new person for those of you where this is new they're going to make you an offer but they're going to be scared to make you this offer and the offer is really you know can we make this relationship exclusive okay and to them that's a huge leap of faith so they're wanting you to take this leap of faith i feel like for both of you it is a leap of faith they're hoping that you do not walk away from this again this is a fear but they are getting beyond this fear they will get beyond this fear because they will make you this offer they're not shying away from this it may take them a little bit to make the offer, but they will. The chariot, see? They're going to move forward. They want you to move forward. If this person is at a distance, one of you would will be moving the death card. The If this is an old person, they want to revive this relationship. They It could be a Scorpio here. They want to reconnect. They want to merge again with you, they're saying. For some of you, this could be a twin. All right, so tell me about the five of chalices here. The knave of swords. Okay, so the person from the past has done a lot of inner reflection here old and new okay they've done a lot of inner reflection and they both have learned a lot i'm not sensing any instability within them i'm feeling virgo if this is from the past they've grown from this experience they're saying the time is now so they may be feeling like, okay, I'm ready. The time is now. Same thing with this uh, new person here. They're going to know when, the, when to make this offer to you. Either way, things are about to change for you. Seven of Wands. You may be a little bit defensive. Either or, past or present here. The Ace of Pentacles is clarifying the King of Chalices here. So I do feel you're going to open up your heart. Now, I don't know. For some some of you, I feel like it's one or the other, either or, past or present. Okay. For others of you, it's like they're both going to be there and you're going to have to choose. Just like Taurus. Very similar. Although with Taurus, the past person wasn't to be trusted. I'm not, I'm not feeling that here. I'm feeling a transformation took place with this individual. I do feel if you decide to move forward, Ace of Chalices, wow. There's going to be a lot of communication that needs to take place about the past. There's going to be a lot of healing that needs to happen here. Knight of Chalices. So you're going to open up your heart, Virgo, to somebody. Now, who that somebody is going to be, that's going to be different for all of you. But know that past or present for whoever I am connecting with, I'm not feeling any instability in either, any shadiness, any ulterior motive. So what is your advice for Virgo? Ace of Wands. Oh my God. So they're wanting you to move forward, okay, with who holds a lot of passion in your heart? Who do you hold a lot of passion for? Who do you get excited about seeing? Who stirs your, they're saying, romantic feelings? They're wanting you to ask yourself these questions. 
four of swords. They're wanting you to make sure that you're healing as well, that you've healed over the past, whether this is a past person or present uh, new person. They're wanting you to make sure that you go within and you do the healing that is necessary. All right, Virgo, let's see what the Oracle has for you for advice here. Oh my gosh resurrection reconsider a project or recall a person from the past to resurrect an idea so a couple of things i'm getting with this okay it doesn't necessarily mean that you need to resurrect a relationship from the past but i do feel that for some of you this person is coming back to trigger this some sort of creative idea or project that you may have talked about with this person because they want you to move forward with it and this is connected to this ace of wands here okay moving forward with this creative idea so it just may be that they're coming back for this trigger but it's again it's going to be up to you virgo whether or not you want to take them back in a romantic sense or if you just want to heal and move on to something new all right virgo i hope this resonated please drop a like below share and subscribe if you already haven't if you're interested in a personal reading that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs information can be found in the description box below don't forget to comment as well let me know if this resonates i want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell that way you get notified whenever i upload a video or go live also don't forget to head on over to my new channel nature speaks 333 and subscribe there i offer daily channelings from the trees uh, for the collective so you have yourself a fantastic day virgo and i will catch you on the flip side on the dailies namaste